So um, probably the easiest way to solve this problem is to actually just pick a number, right? I know when to pick numbers. If I see, oops, sorry, if I see a variable in my question and then I see that same variable in my answer choices, right? A, B, C, and D, I'll have D in it, right? So um, I know that I eat seven cans, right? in per three days, right? They want to know how much a dog is going to eat in three plus D days, right? I'm going to make D, right? What should I make D equal to? The best thing to make it equal to would be three, right? Because I don't even really have to do any math then. I know that in three days it eats seven cans, right? How many food cans of food does the dog eat in three plus in the three these three days plus D days, which we made three? Seven plus seven is 14 total cans, right? Now, we made D equal to three, right? So that means when we plug our D into these answer choices, whichever one tells us it also equals 14 is going to be our correct answer, right? Answer choice A would be 7 plus, right, 7 times 3 divided by 3, which is 7 plus 21 over 3, which is 7 plus 7, which equals 14, and we have a winner, answer choice A. Um, generally, when you pick numbers, it's useful to just really quickly go through your other answer choices and make sure that it's the only one that, you know, equals like the 14 here because maybe you have to pick another number if the two answer choices work out, right? Um, so we have answer choice A, um, which we'll keep, but B would be seven thirds plus plus three. This isn't even going to be an integer. C is going to be seven thirds plus one. That would be one and seven thirds. That's not going to be 14. D is going to be seven thirds plus seven over 21, which would be seven thirds plus a third. That's not going to be it. And so we'd be again left with answer choice A. So again, I just assigned a letter or a number to D um, three, which made it seven cans, added that up to 14, plugged in what I chose, chose for my D and whichever one's um, produce the exact same number that I got from um, assigning the number to D is going to be the correct answer.